Now to good health. The nationwide flu epidemic continues, but influenza not the only virus making people sick right now. And that's causing a little bit of confusion. Yeah. So our Dr. Frank McGeorge is here with another of the many viruses that are going around and causing some similar symptoms. Exactly. Basically, it's called adenovirus. And like the flu, it can cause fever, sore throat, cough, and a runny nose. Now, here's the thing. This paper, which was just published in a CDC journal, well, it's attracted some attention, making the case that these adenovirus infections may be underestimated. And unlike influenza, adenovirus occurs all year round. If you're feeling miserable, it could certainly be the flu, but some people are also getting sick from another family of viruses known as adenoviruses. In addition to flu-like symptoms, these viruses can also cause pink eye and diarrhea in children. Although most adenovirus infections are mild, in rare cases, adenovirus can lead to pneumonia. Typically, the virus is spread by coughing, sneezing, and direct contact with an infected person. You can also get the viruses by touching contaminated surfaces, like door handles and light switches, where the viruses can live for long periods of time. Now, if you do get sick, symptoms typically last for about 10 days. For most patients, rest, fluids, and over-the-counter medications are the only treatment necessary. But, as with any infection, if your symptoms are severe or getting worse, call your doctor. So how do you know if you have the flu or another infection like adenovirus? Well, the short answer is it may be hard to tell, although the flu is definitely more common in the winter and it typically causes more body aches. Also, we can test you for influenza, but given that we're in the middle of an influenza epidemic, most doctors are going to treat you as if it's the flu because odds are that is what it is. There's not many options for either of these as far as treatment goes anyway, right? Just treating the, the symptoms as best you can. Pretty much, although with the flu in high-risk groups, Tamiflu may be recommended. Uh, uh, or yes. an antiviral, yeah, yeah. but with adenovirus, yeah, you pretty much just let it run its yeah, course. Yeah. Yep. Thank you. Right